Hey guys, uh, David Parker 3 here again, and um, I'm using this new camera that I got. Um, a while ago, I had posted um, asking them, you guys at Blade Forum some uh, questions concerning this carburetor that I have on this Honda uh, Harmony HRT 216. Um, I don't seem to be have, uh, I don't seem to have fuel going into the engine. Um, my fuel lines are clear and whatnot. I think the problem is the carburetor. So I'm going to disassemble this real quick in front of you guys and uh, show you how I've had it together this time. And maybe you all can tell me something. So it's uh, bolted together to the back of this through here. And it corresponds with these bolts like that. Um, and now I'm gonna take it apart. So let's start with that. Okay. So this is my gasket. Uh, my first gasket that's in between, I guess, the carburetor itself and the intake, I guess, or whatever part you call that right there. Let's see if we can get a zoom in on. Oh. Come on, camera. This guy. And then we'll zoom back out. I'll show you what the heck I'm dealing with. Okay, so that's the first gasket. I had that lined up like this. This guy, the next plastic piece, this, uh, you can see that this indentation right here, I have this lined up with, I guess, the airline of something along of that sort. That sits there. My next gasket, this lines up this, uh, I guess, heat plate. I'm not sure what this is technically called. I had the hole, again, like I said, lined up with the, I guess, airflow intake on this plastic piece. And that sits via that. No gasket on this piece. Um, and I guess I had a gasket fall out in between this and the wall of this itself. Um, Let's see if I can take this apart real quick for you guys. And that is leaking fluid quite a bit. Let's get these parts out of the way so they don't get soaked. Stay in folk frame for you guys. Okay. So there is my the inside. I don't think it looks too dirty if you guys can see in there. Um, I think it looks pretty clean. And this is my uh, float valve. And I think it seems to be, you know, I don't know, moving pretty well in a sense. Floats, I guess. So it's like this. Let me turn that right for you. Right, and I'll remove the little pin, take that out, and there's my pin in there, it looked like it was installed correctly I thought, and it's still, I thought it looked pretty clean, I don't know what I'm doing wrong, I've cleaned this thing with uh, carb cleaner, carburetor cleaner left and right, um, and I, I think it's just an assembly process, so Again, maybe y'all have some input in order to tell me why I'm being basically a dumbass with this um, and what I'm doing wrong because uh, I want to get this mower up and running. I have another one, but I need to get rid of this guy and sell it. And um, what am I doing? You know? So, um, yeah, let me know, guys. I appreciate it. Thank you. And if there's anything else I need to post in terms of a close up or something, feel free to let me know. Um, and I will uh, get right on that, okay? Thanks, guys.